Hey guys, it's Friday evening. Uh, well, technically it'd be Saturday morning because it's 12.27 in the morning. I just got home from work, uh, so I'm going to uh, throw in the roast beef into the slow cooker and uh, cook that overnight. So let's see what we got. Um, we got a roast beef. Let's see here. Got it on special. And we're going to put some red onion in. Some... I'll have to like cut that really good because that's some green and we don't want that. That's poisonous. It's on uh we got some potatoes, we got some carrots, small turnip, some garlic, celery, um I don't know, I might put in some portobellos. We have room. And um we got some <coughs> we have some Brussels sprouts. Uh I might be throwing you around. <laughs> You might be thinking, ew, Brussels sprouts are gross, but they're really good for you. Um, I used to hate it growing up, but it's not too bad with cheese whiz. But cooked it off the roast might be pretty good, actually. I've never done it, but... Um, and if there's still room, I might put broccoli. I actually might not. I don't know. I don't think there's going to be any room, but... Yeah, so I'm going to get that all ready for you. Rachel Ray recommends having a garbage bowl <clears throat> and another bowl to put your stuff in, but I'm just going to throw it into the crock pot, so yeah, it's a garbage bowl and food bowl. Normally I wouldn't peel the potatoes to put it in there, um, but these are, I don't know, there's a little bit of green under the skin, I, it's really not good for you to eat that, so I'm just going to peel them. Um, I'm actually just going to season it first. I already put it in, but I'll just take it back out. Um, let's see. I'm going to put salt, salt and pepper. Uh, what else do I want to put on there? Let's see. I'm not going to put the mushrooms in. Um, there's not enough room. Obviously, that's, that's pretty full. So, let me put the mushrooms back in the bag. Let's see. I washed my hands <laughs> after I touched the meat. Um, ginger vlogs, just touch the the meat. It, it's not a huge deal. It, it's just it's just meat. <laughs> All right, let's see here. I want a salt and pepper. Um, what else? I 
Let me see. Okay, this is how I usually tell what um, what spices I want is by opening them and smelling them. Just just to let you know. So I think I'm gonna put basil. Um, what else? just because. Mm, what else do I want to put on? Hmm. Let's see. I think I'm just going to keep it simple, actually. I'm just going to put those four in, just because. don't want to get too fancy today. Keep it simple. Just touch the meat, ginger bugs. It's not going to kill you. <laughs> That's how you do it! So that's what it looks like. I'm going to just put a little bit of water in there. Just, you know, hydrate it up. But, uh, yeah. So that's what that looks like. Um, and <clears throat> then what I'm going to do, I'm going to throw it on low for probably, uh, I'm going to put it on, here. I'm going to put it on low for 12 hours, I think. One time. Well, that'll be like one. Hmm. Yeah, I'll put I'll click it for like twelve hours. Maybe eleven. No, I'll put it on twelve and I'll check on it. Alright, so that's that's that. It's all in there. Yum, I think that's gonna be good. Yeah, so uh I'll show you tomorrow. Oh yeah. Um so yeah, that little trick about the uh, the garbage bowl, um, that's from Rachel Ray. She's one of my favorite chefs. Um, yeah, that's the garbage bowl right now. It's full of little peelings and stuff. Um, it's really helpful. If you can do it, do it. It saves you a lot of hassle. That's a good idea. So just throw it out. Alright guys, that's what it is. It's pretty good.